Is that is that the famous promoter? I, did you? Were you the famous promoter that brought all the stars to Century Club? Were you the guy that brought Dr. Dre and Snoop Dogg and Jay Z? You brought all of them. I know. You keep going. You brought uh, Prince. You brought who else? You bring to our club? Yeah. You brought everybody. But you know what? You're not on the list. You ain't coming in. Aisha. This is this is the promoter. The promoter. This is my promoter. It's the one and only Dr. David. No, no, right, wait, wait. No, no, no. we what? was his nigga. We was niggas <laughs> before it was they niggas. What? We was the niggas. It's the one and only What? That, what you talking no, about? Come on, man. Don't be racist on, on me. Brad, and I hated him. <laughs> <laughs> and this is Burr. What a sex. Yeah, I know her. I remember. And Mark made the whole success of the bar method. I met Sebastian at the Hawaiian Tropics with Christian Lassen oh, and no, Jerry no, Buss. No, and Jerry Buss said, 16, <laughs> Jerry Buss said, that's one of the best looking guys I've ever seen. Jerry Buss, Dr. Buss. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Oh my wait. God, you're so excited. Wait, go ahead, Sebastian. <laughs> Whoa! The 4th of July. And right there is the fireworks. Right there. Right there. Mark, we're overcrowded. Look, the fire marshal came to bus us. Mark. The fire marshal's behind you. What are you going to do with this guy? Run, Mark. Run. How are you, sir? <laughs> <laughs> Did you go out with Brad? <laughs> you changed the course of my life. Hey. There you go. When I started working for you at Century Club, I was driving from the Laguna Hills every day to work and I loved my job. And then the Century Club shut down and you took me to tattoo. Jen in the house! <laughs> Who's this, Sebastian? Excuse me, you're my little grandson. You can't be doing this, Sebastian. <laughs> Come upstairs, let's eat. Alright. Sebastian, are you six foot five? Is he is he tall, dark, and handsome? Handsome, huh? <laughs> Look at these guys just drooling over this beautiful woman. <laughs> Look at the dirty old men. There's a movie about you guys and the hot young girl they both wanted to meet. <laughs> The bar method. This is the princess of the bar method. She's in great shape. <laughs> this is the party for Mark. Yep, Sebastian. Chef. Newly <laughs> single. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are there any guys out there? Sebastian? Brock? Would you like? Great guy. Would you mind dating a nice young man? I don't think I'm his type. You might be. Um, you can cook. You're his type. He eats like a horse. All he does is eat. You know a way to get in his heart? Do I get to his heart right here? You give him some of this stuff. That's your Walters. Yes, I want to be a producer like you. So yes. this, this is a compliment he just gave me. And he's the biggest, biggest movie producer now and agent, right? Well, we all aspire to be like Danny. That's for sure. We always look up to him. So Richard and Norby Walters' dad had the biggest parties ever at Century Club. That of a hundred stars. They were unbelievable. And so Mark, he couldn't wait to come see you. I heard you were leaving town. I want you to come by and wish you well. One hell of a power table here. We got everybody. Hey. Were you the promoter that brought everybody to the club? I'm the promoter that brought the blackness to the Century Club. It's you or this guy right here yeah. that made it the most talked about venue. Just tell me some of the people you brought. Oh my God. From Jay Z, Mike Tyson, Puffy, uh, Pac, uh, Snoop Dogg, Michael Jordan. Uh, Prince, God. Prince, oh man, uh, baby face, baby face, uh, Monica, Brandy. I mean, I, uh, uh, who oh, played in the VIP room all the time? Prince, oh, oh, Harry Chronic Jr., Holly Berry hanging yeah. out in yeah. here. I mean, it, it, come on, man. Yeah. Oh wait, who was Mark's best friend? Uh, James. Rick James. Ma oh, yeah. Mark created a China club with Rick James in the club. Rick, you know, Mark knew how to get down for the blacks. Let me just keep it real. Ah! 
for almost seven, eight years on Black Night. What? And, That's racist. And you can't say Black Night. Just say that. When I first met Mark, it's okay for you to say Mark huh? told me, and I'm going to remember this the rest of my life. Mark told me I was, I'm 62 now. When That's I was old. in about 23, That's Mark old, told huh? me, he said, Curtis, the best lawsuit is a settled lawsuit. Yeah. Mark taught me that. All about lawsuits. Thank you, Mark, for all that education. Uh, so we are the motherfuckers. Yeah, you two was the Me and Mark were the motherfuckers. That's not funny. Oh, wait, are you falling for this? Are you okay with this? I've never heard such a wonderful insult before. <laughs> I threatened Are you okay with this? So Are you okay? <laughs> so is this like your is this like a mom to you right here, right? Was she like the best mom in the world? Spoiled you rotten? Huh? Good friend. <laughs> You're cute sisters. Look at you guys. Yes. Now, did you see Uncle Bob and Dad all over her? They were all over your sister. Oh, I couldn't believe it. <laughs> Bob, Bob, are we overcrowded? Are we overcrowded? Yes. No. Yes. Are, are we overcrowded? No. For once, you got a place that I can recognize everyone and know who they are. I think we're overcrowded. The fire marshal came to bust us. Oh, uh -huh. great! Is that the Brazilian fire marshal? Yeah, the Brazilian yeah. fire marshal. <laughs> Is that the fire marshal from Rio. <laughs> the real uh, this is what you call girl power, Sebastian. The girls took over the kitchen, and look at it. We have the beautiful, the beautiful blonde chef, the Puerto Rican chef, and the black chef. So why did I hate you so much, Brad? <laughs> um, because we slept with all the same women. <laughs> <laughs> no, you stole my women. He stole them, Mark. Not very fair. I'm so mad at him. <laughs> and our friends. Oh my God. Yeah, and he fun. dated your secretary, Mark. So Kelly, excuse me. Come here. Practice, you guys. Now, later on, we're going to take Mark upstairs, and the fireworks are going to be behind him, and we're going to have all this fireworks going off behind Mark. Sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan? <laughs> it is a plan.